You are now watching 100 TV, where we always keep it 100 over here. No clickbait, no cab news, just real authentic content. The 100 way. So right now, man, we have some really good news. And this young woman right here deserves to get her flowers right now. And that's what we is doing. So shout out to this young lady, man, because this is, this is just some brilliant news right here. 17 year old Kamora Freeland made history. She got her private pilot's license, making her the youngest African American female to get the license in New York State. Let's clap for her. Let's clap for her, y'all. That girl is 17 years old. She just passed her license. She is the youngest pilot, man. She is about to be flying them big planes, man. This right here is history, y'all. This is history. Let's clap for her, man. She is the youngest pilot, man. This girl is 17 years old. Most 17-year-old girls are not on that type of time. This girl right here is focused. You got to tilt your hat to her, man. Yo, that girl ain't out there smoking weed. She ain't out there partying. She ain't out there having babies at 15. That girl is focused. And we are proud of her parents and her family for keeping her on the right track. Because this is a major accomplishment. So let's give it up for her, man. Mm -hmm. You see, content like this ain't going to get no light. Because people only feed off of the bad things, you know. But me, I'm going to show some light on it. I have a child too. So this makes me very proud to see a young woman living in these times stay on the right track and achieve all of her goals. Shout out to her, man. Let's give her her flowers right now. The youngest female African-American pilot in New York State, man. Tilt my hat to her because I don't even like getting on a plane. More or less flying it. You got some balls, baby. Because I couldn't do it. I ain't going to lie. I can't fly no plane, y'all. Kamora Freeland. Keep doing your thing, baby girl. Keep shining like the star you is. And just keep that tunnel vision. But right now, we is about to check out some content of the youngest female African-American pilot. Let's check it out, man. And don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. It's 100 TV. A teenager from Staten Island, New York, set out to fly away into the record books. ABC's Danny New has more on this 17-year-old who's out to prove that the sky is the limit. We're going back to the DMV. It's over? It's over. For most teenagers, passing your road test is hard enough, as F. All right, guys, here we go. But for 17-year-old Kamora Freeland, who at 16 became one of the youngest women in American history to complete a solo flight this past October, where she is going, she doesn't need roads. I have a passion for it, and I love it. After completing that first solo venture, Squawk 135197 golf. And then her cross country solo back in January. On Monday, Kimura set out to officially become the youngest black woman in New York State history to earn her private pilot's license. I live in Atlanta and I came to see it, yeah. I wouldn't miss it for the world. Family traveled from all over to watch Kimura take her hour long test with an examiner, some standing in awe, channeling how I think many of us would feel. Me? I'm scared of heights, so I ain't going, you know what I'm saying? I'm not going to be, to see her doing this, it's like just amazing. She said I'm bad. Oh. Well, after successfully landing the plane, 
<laughs> and getting a hug from mom, Kimura got to celebrate making history with her family. I didn't see this a year and a half ago. And to be here and to see it with my own two eyes, I'm grateful. So proud of you. Bro. Now, Kimura says she's ready to start college in the fall and to earn her commercial pilot's license. It's really amazing. Like, I'm a part of the change that's definitely needed. I want other little black girls to do the same. You are now watching 100 TV, where we always keep it 100 over here. No clickbait, no cab news, just real authentic content. The 100 West.